Good day everyone. Welcome to Teacher Julie channel. Hello everyone, we have our new topic in Science 7, which is all about cell parts and its function. This will be the second quarter topic and week 4. This topic is a milk-based. For the most essential learning competencies, after going through this lesson, you are expected to explain why the cell is considered the basic structural and functional unit of all organisms. Specifically, you are also expected to First is to identify the different cell organelles and its function. The second one is to explain why cell is considered the basic structural and functional unit of all organisms. And the third one is to make a cell model. Life comes from life. Have you ever wondered what your body is made up of? Or how your body maintains, adapts, and changes through time? In this lesson, you are going to learn the unseen workers within your body that works hard in order for you to enjoy life to the fullest. The first activity is called Name Game. For the directions, all you have to do is to identify the following images as cell, tissue, organ, organ system, organism, population, ecosystem, community, and biosphere. Cell is the basic unit of life. All life forms are made up of cell. When Robert Hooke carefully examined a very thin slice of cork, he thought the close-up view resembled small empty rooms. He referred these tiny rooms as cells, from the Latin word cellulae, which means small rooms. A cell is made up of tiny organs, called organelles, that perform specific functions. It is called organelles because it is like little organs that has its own function. The following are the different cell organelles and its function. The nucleus houses DNA or the hereditary material as well as various proteins and the nucleolus, considered as the brain of the cell because it directs all the activities of the cell. Another cell organelle is the mitochondrion. The plural term is mitochondria. Mitochondria are some of the largest organelles within a cell. It is also known as the powerhouse of the cell. It is where the energy of the cell, the ATP or the adenosine triphosphate, is produced. 
Another cell organelle is the ribosomes. Ribosomes are very tiny organelles like dots that contain RNA and specific proteins within the cytoplasm. Within the cell, ribosomes are directly involved in the manufacture of proteins. Another cell organelle is the rough endoplasmic reticulum. Unlike the smooth endoplasmic reticulum or ER, rough ER has ribosome attached to its surface. It is involved in the manufacture of various proteins in the cell. On the other hand, the rough ER is involved in the production of antibodies, insulin, as well as transportation of proteins into the smooth endoplasmic reticulum. Another cell organelle is the smooth endoplasmic reticulum. The smooth endoplasmic reticulum is named so because it lacks a ribosome on its surface. As a result, it is smoother in appearance as compared to the rough ER. It is involved in the synthesis of lipids, example the phospholipids and carbohydrates that are used to build the cell membrane. Other functions of the smooth ER are the following. The transportation of vesicles, enzyme production in the liver, contraction of muscle cells in the muscles, Synthesis of hormones in the brain cells. Another cell organelle is the Golgi bodies or the Golgi apparatus. The Golgi apparatus is responsible for transporting, modifying, and packaging proteins and lipids into vesicles for delivery to targeted destination. It is located in the cytoplasm next to endoplasmic reticulum and near the cell nucleus. While many types of cell contain only one or several Golgi apparatus, plant cells can contain hundreds. Another cell organelle is the lysosomes. Lysosomes act as the waste disposal system of the cell by digesting obsolete or unused materials in the cytoplasms from both inside and outside the cell. Thus, lysosomes are also called the suicidal bugs of the cell. Another cell organelle is the vacuoles. A vacuole may be described as a space inside the cell that does not contain cytoplasm. It is surrounded by a membrane and filled with fluid. Vacuoles store various molecules including enzymes, waste products of the cell, water, and even food material depending on the type of cell. Another cell organelle is the chloroplast. Chloroplast contain the pigment chlorophyll that captures energy from sunlight for photosynthesis. Therefore, the chloroplast is the site of photosynthesis, the process through which plants produce food. Animal cell has no chloroplast, thus animal cannot make their own food. Another cell organelle is the plasma membrane. The plasma membrane, the cell membrane, is the organelle that encapsulates the contents of the cell. It is like a fence or a gatekeeper that protects the cell from the outside environment. It is also controls what materials can go in and out of the cell. The plasma membrane is made up of two layers of phospholipids, the phospholipids bilayer. Another cell organelle is the cell wall. A cell wall is a rigid, semi-permeable, protective layer in some cell types. This outer covering is positioned next to the cell membrane or the plasma membrane in most plant cells, fungi, bacteria, algae, and some archaea. Animal cells, however, do not have a cell wall. The cell wall has many important functions in the cell including protection, structure, and support. Another cell organelle is the cytoplasm. It is where all the organelles are located. It has a jelly-like fluid. 
Another cell organelle is the centrioles. Centrioles are tube-like structures that aid in cell division. They generally are found close to the nucleus and are made up of nine tube-like structures that each have three tubules. Centrioles are found inside the centrosome. Centrioles separate the chromosome during animal cell division. Centrioles are only found in animal cell. Thank you.